Jeff Jarrett joins AEW as Director of Business Development. New Japan Pro Wrestling Shibata requested AEW matches with Brian Danielson and Orange Cassidy. Dwayne The Rock Johnson shares first look at Becky Lynch on Young Rock as Cindy Lauper. Bianca Belair and Montez Ford Hulu series in production and more. Happy Thursday, everyone. We got a lot of news to get into here today, so I'm going to go ahead and kick things off with Jeff Jarrett's new role in AEW. Take a look. Jeff Jarrett's debut on AEW Dynamite was enough of a surprise on Wednesday, but nearly an hour after the show, AEW head Tony Khan doubled down by announcing that Jeff Jarrett had been hired as the company's director of business development. Tony Khan tweeted the news saying he is looking forward to expanding the company's live event calendar next year and in the future years with Jeff Jarrett, Chris Harrington, Raphael Morphy, and others. Jeff Jarrett appeared on screen on Dynamite, nailing Darby Allen with a guitar shot and aligning with Sanjay Dutt, Jay Lethal, and Satnam Singh. He cut a promo afterward indicating that he will be around AEW for a while and will be leaving people in body bags. It's the fourth official promotion Jarrett has appeared for this year, a list that also includes WWE, GCW, and the NWA. He was also a major part of Ric Flair's last match, Pay Per View. Just this May, Jeff Jarrett was announced as WWE Senior Vice President of Live Events and departed the company in August, shortly after Vince McMahon resigned. The surprising match made for AEW's Rampage this Friday between Orange Cassidy and Shibata was actually requested by Shibata himself. According to Meltzer, Shibata told AEW he wanted two matches in the company, one of them against Cassidy and the other being against Brian Danielson. Shibata was free this week and thus they made the Cassidy match for Friday's live show from Atlantic City, New Jersey. It's unknown if there's a planned date for the Danielson match. Shibata made a surprise appearance on Wednesday's Dynamite appearing after Cassidy's three-way title defense victory over Ray Phoenix and Luchasaurus. He made the save for Cassidy as Pac was beating him down after the match. Because Cassidy won, he got to choose his dream opponent for Friday. Shibata pointed at Cassidy and the title, and Cassidy handed him the contract to sign. There is a history between the two in AEW, as in another surprise appearance, Shibata saved Cassidy from a beatdown from the United Empire following Cassidy's loss to Will Ospreay at June's Forbidden Door. Dwayne The Rock Johnson has confirmed Becky Lynch's role on the season 3 premiere of Young Rock. In an Instagram post on Thursday morning, Johnson shared three photos of Lynch playing music star Cindy Lauper on the Young Rock episode. The new season premieres on NBC this Friday at 8.30 p.m. Eastern Time. The Rock wrote on his Instagram saying, quote, Becky takes on the daunting and fun task of playing the one and only the icon Cindy Lauper. I was right there for Becky's audition and we were all very impressed at her high level commitment as an actor to become Cindy Lauper. No easy task, but she worked her butt off and went all in and crushed it. Additionally, Nick Khan revealed yesterday during WWE's third quarter investors call that a WWE series focused on Bianca Belair and Montez Ford is coming to Hulu, an eight episode series with the first season currently in production. Well, what are your thoughts on these stories? Go ahead and let us know in the comment section below. As always, do not forget to subscribe to F4W online. And if you would like to chat pro wrestling with me, feel free to give me a follow on Twitter and or on Instagram at underscore Denise Salcedo. See you on the next vid. Also available to watch now is my AEW Dynamite post show.